If you think planning your Christmas is stressful, spare a thought for the Queen. Her Christmases at Sandringham are legendary. What with the exclusive guest list, the very public trip to the local church and her 3pm address to the nation, Her Majesty has a lot to live up to every December the 25th. And she's been hosting the party for a very long time. Like a good hostess, the Queen arrives early, often by public transport. The festivities start on Christmas Eve and those lucky enough to be invited are told what time they must arrive and to complicate things, they need to arrive in reverse order of royal importance. By four o'clock, everyone gets together in the white drawing room for tea and no doubt a sausage on a stick, whilst the younger royals finish decorating the tree. The organised fun doesn't stop there, apparently, as each guest is presented with a timetable for the holiday. The family follow the German tradition of opening presents on Christmas Eve. It's said that gifts are laid out on tables, again in order of royal importance. And if you ever find yourself invited to Sandringham on this fancy occasion, don't worry about trying to find something expensive for the family that has everything. Apparently, the royals love to share joke gifts. Word is the winter start Christmas Day with a full English breakfast before heading off to church. And then it's back for a turkey dinner with all the trimmings. And just like normal families, they sit down at three so they can watch the Queen's speech. But believe it or not, the Queen prefers to watch it alone. The family then spend the rest of the day doing pretty normal things, like playing board games and watching telly. We're pretty sure there's no arguing over the washing up, though.